it's sad that this is the situation we're in. We're supposed to be such a rich country. There's thousands and thousands of people in the food lines. Mid-March, we were at 500 families. We saw a surge to 1,200 the following week. There's the cars all around waiting to get in line to get bare necessities of life. We've seen a lot of people uh, being affected by coronavirus here. Morning, you guys be safe. Thank you for the service. Thank you, sir. You know, I think we're seeing a lot of the surge of people that are recently unemployed. We've had Uber drivers in our lines. We've had uh, gig workers. We've seen uh, people that have always had jobs suddenly out of work and they haven't known where to turn. It's uh, pretty widespread. I'm on the phone talking to my sister who's in the parking lot here somewhere. You know, like my sister and I are both on social security and substitute teachers, so we're not able to supplement our income to pay to pay our bills, you know, so it makes it very hard. And these are folks that are used to working. I'm a musician, so I rely on parties, people contracting us. I play for weddings, birthday parties. People don't want to get contaminated with coronavirus, so there's no more parties. <laughs> I know, me too. Normally I would buy at the grocery store. I, I didn't think I would ever rely on this, but I'm here right now. Oh, We are prepared to be here until May 1st right now. We'll keep watching those unemployment numbers and we'll go beyond that if we need to. I haven't been able to make any money. It's just the world has crashed around me. <laughs> There's nothing I can do. It's sad. It's really sad. It makes me upset. We'll need to make some adjustments for the heat as it comes on. What I'm usually used to getting paid as far as my job goes has been not there. I'm not getting the hours I usually get. But we could continue to distribute to large volumes of uh, people for you know the entire summer if we need to. I'm 36, so in the years I've been alive, it's I've never seen a situation like this where so many people have lost their jobs, so many people are forced to stay home. 